It's locked. Kick the door in. Kick the door. Whoa, hey there. Hang hey on. There, guys. That might not be necessary. Yeah, but it's fun. Your name's Hiroshi, right? <laughs> you remembered me. I took your lunch money once. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, water under the bridge. Anyway, the mall is supposed to be open, but that security guard, Pattinson, must be asleep at home again. How do we get inside? Just hang out here for a while. He'll eventually wake up and come to work. What? Seriously? No, we need to get in there now. We have reasons, important ones. Hey, me too. The latest issue of Cosmic Mega Babes just got released. And if you think I'm going to download the digital manga version, <laughs> you are sadly mistaken. I don't know what any of that means. Where's this guard live? North Ravine Lane. But I wouldn't recommend waking him. I, uh, I tried that once. Thanks, Hiroshi. We'll be right back. Get out of my house! Oh, I didn't know that was a table! <laughs> you bastard. What am I supposed to do when I get over there? Let's go. Keys acquired. Let's get back to the mall. No, we got the keys. See? We got the keys, bro. Nice job. And now open these doors so we can start shopping. Squee! No. Squee. But Kyoko, just a few stores. Remember, Ricky? <sighs> okay, let's go find that spooky Amada guy. XP earned, let's go. Alright. Oh, hey, Hiroshi. Did Hiroshi? You get Space Girls comic book thingy? Uh, Cosmic Mega Babes? Cosmic yeah, Mega but babes. they only had the standard edition cover. Ugh. Ugh. I could barely bring myself to read it three times. We can't find Yamada. Anywhere else he might be? He also hangs around the construction site. But if you go there, be careful. Why? Because Why? it's a construction site. Oh, yeah. Anyway, thanks and stuff. Anytime. I mean, like, literally anytime. My life is pretty boring. Aw, oh, you gotta be shitting me. All right. Should we get another boss? <laughs> oh, fuck. He's gonna have power. Ladies, welcome to my lair. This is a rooftop. Yeah, not <laughs> even a finished one. It, rooftops can be lairs. Whatever, we're looking for Kunio and Ricky. That big girl said you hang out with them, do ya? <laughs> As if. Those guys are losers. What did he say Ooh. about my Ricky Pill? Chill, Kyoko. I'll chill this guy's face! Relax. Good I haven't God. talked to him in years. I thought you guys were friends. We were. A long time ago. What's happening? <sighs> it's a flashback. No one cares, Yamada! We were just kids then. I was 10 years old when my family moved to River City. I hated them for moving. I hated having to leave my friends behind. I hated lots of things. I hate Is this gonna take long? I was sure I'd never make another friend. But as we unpacked, this boy across the street said hello. His name was Cunio, and he seemed nice. He is nice. Now where is he? Is Ricky in the story? Cunio and I became best friends. We read comics together, watched TV, Played intergalactic space rangers. Life was good. Aw, see, that's sweet. Only because Kunio's in it. Then one day, a girl transferred to our school. Her name was Hasabe, and she was an angel. It was the first and last time I ever fell in love. Hasabe, oh, I can't stand her. Yeah, she's sort of the worst. I she's ran to the park sort of the worst. Day, 
excited to tell my best friend Kunio about the girl I would soon marry. Wait, aren't you like 10? Yeah, that's pretty weird, dude. But when I got to the park, Kunio was already there. And so was Hasabe. Oh, dang, that's hecka sad. Or Kunio, maybe. That trash girl never deserved him. That night, I decided I would get my revenge on Kunio, on Hasabe, on everyone. I turn to the dark arts to become stronger. That's creepy. Hell? I don't like scary things. Wrap it up, Merlin. Then later, middle school. Wrap it okay. up, Merlin. We get it, jeez. Wrap it up, Merlin. I lost the love of my life and my best friend in the same day. But thanks to the dark arts, I would never again be. Okay, wait up. Love of your life? You barely met the girl. Did he even meet her? Wait, yeah, did <laughs> you even meet her? Love needs no introduction. That's not how love works. Listen, freak show. I don't care about your childhood, your crush on trash queens, or any <laughs> fakey magic tricks you learned. We're looking for Kunio. And Ricky. And Ricky. So either and tell Ricky. us who took him, or stop wasting our time. <laughs> you girls are all the same. We look nothing alike. <laughs> always insulting me, always treating me like dirt. You look like dirt. Dang. You know, part of why I learned the dark arts was to meet girls. <laughs> Looks like that's about to pay off. Ew. Ew. Yamada. All right. Put up your ass. It's about to get dark. <laughs> God damn it. Damn it! Can't hit that shit. Try any more of that magic crap on us. Yeah, yeah cuz it's spooky. Seriously, I can't even watch horror movies. <laughs> Never thought I'd get beat up by a pair of girls. I could have guessed it. 
We won the battle, so tell us where our boyfriends are. I have no idea. Jesus. Why does this keep happening? You really have no idea? We miss him pretty bad. Try Uptown. Sometimes they hang out there after school. How do you know that? I hang out on top of a building all day, remember? I see lots of things. That's that weird. True. And sad, but whatever. See you later, Creepy. See you later, Creepy. A love letter? Defeating the Dark Arts Achievement Gata. K.O. Yamada.